CES may stand for Consumer Electronics Show, but whilst this isn't necessarily a piece of consumer electronics, it is something I want to show you. You know when uh, when you were a kid and you learned CPR for the first time on one of those plastic mannequins? Well now I'd like to introduce you to Adam X, training doll and CPR doll from the future. Now Adam X is not just for CPR training, although you can use it for that purpose, because in fact, it's a real sort of full-size model of a human being with loads of amazing features built in. So for instance, uh, the skin is able to sense where you are when you're doing chest compressions. Um, there is a, a monitor where you can actually see where your hands are and see whether you're in the right place. Inside here are independently operated lungs, which will inflate and deflate depending on what you do. The eyes, the pupils will actually uh, tighten or dilate depending on what you're doing. Tongue can swell or roll back and actually this can be used if you're like intubating a patient with one of those sort of J-shaped tubes. All of this will feed back not only to the computer that Adam X is connected to but also with real symptoms. So for instance, uh, Adam X's cheeks can flush or uh, go very pale. If oxygen is, is kind of lost, the extremities will turn a light purple. The feedback you get if you're training with one of these things is the same sort of feedback that you would get with a real patient. One of the big advantages of a device like Adam X is that you don't use simulated tools. You can actually use a real ECG, even a real defibrillator. Fundamentally, this is about getting uh, medics, doctors, nurses, and anyone else in the medical profession uh, the chance to really get up close and personal with a patient that is as close to the real thing as you can imagine. The whole thing, the software basis, is so sophisticated that you can set uh, various scenarios. So, you know, collapsed lung, what do you do? Well, you can actually pierce the skin um, with, with a needle and release all of that air. And because it's a real independently operated lung, the air will rush out. You can also um, connect up an IV and you'll get feedback on that. At the minute, it's just audio clips that will play that come out of a little speaker sort of close to the mouth. In a couple of uh, weeks, they're actually going to uh, activate an, an update to this, which will enable you to actually ask it questions and have a sort of GPT style model produce answers. Now, I don't know if you know this, this is a little bit of trivia I found out, but you know uh, in the song Smooth Criminal, um, when uh, Michael Jackson sings Annie, Are You OK? Well, that, if you remember, is the thing you're meant to ask the Resussy Annie doll to check that they're doing okay. So now, quite literally, you can ask Adam if they are okay. This is obviously not something that you or I would buy because to get kind of the full featured model with all of the bells and whistles, I mean, you can do loads of things I haven't even mentioned, like remove limbs, put on bleeding limbs, do kind of surgical practices and everything else. But if you want all of that, it's gonna be $70,000, which means this is more the preserve of medical schools, universities, even like, you know, army combat medic training uh, type places. And it's just worth saying, it is absolutely extraordinary to think that we've gone from those little kind of slightly creepy uh, CPR dolls to something now where it gives you feedback in real time. It gives you real feedback. One of the scenarios you can set is that it has a seizure and I was watching as the scenario activated and all the limbs started to uh, vibrate in turn. It is absolutely extraordinary. And with any luck, this will enable the medics of the future to have a much greater understanding of what they need to do in a crisis. For more information about this and all of the other amazingly exciting things we've seen at CES 2024, please visit engadget.com and do not forget to like and subscribe uh, this channel and this video.